uh, for folks who have been um, being skeptical about this one old deal this is what we're doing right now this is um, approximately um, 18 40 hours in the evening afternoon evening like so this is the the grid tide power jack that one I installed for my friend so that's the power is bringing in right now so I can able to show you guys the uh, the total that you already put into the stuff all right folks you see that's a 6.875 kilowatt hours of power if you look at the video that um, um, I install from and this is just two uh, 250 watt solar modules polycrystalline and uh, you already make that kind of power the Titan series and uh, you guys can take a look at the uh, system again here and here this fans never turn on at all so you guys can go back and see the video on these and uh, see the kind of power this thing has already generated. Close look again, take a look at it. And I have the opportunity, like I told you guys, I have to see if he's home, then uh, I can stop and see if I can film this again. There we go, we're cranking the power again. He's outside the grilling, so that, <laughs> that's why I keep on... Uh, blocking it in hey we're bringing a 180 watt 180 watts from two from 500 watt solar panel a total of uh, 250 each so machine is working oh, working for him pretty good he's so happy about it and uh 180 watt not bad at all for uh, um six at six six forty so it's it's collecting from the evening sun now I like that well just want to show you guys since uh we talked about this I promise and he's pushing back uh one point five amps back to the grid hundred and eighty watt so power factor is zero point nine seven two so the grid is the uh, the 123. That's a good power right there. You got a clean clean power. 123.2 volt, pushing 180 watts. I would take this all day. But he's not putting into batteries, and this guy here is doing his thing. You can see it running back and forth. So that's the uh, the 320 solar panel right there. And this is the entire system. I'll give you guys a clean look a little portable system and he's so happy about it and pretty soon I'm gonna see talk to him and see what you guys he's gonna tell you guys about the entire project itself but power is fluctuating you got a big tree on the back there keeps shadowing the entire power I don't like that tree yeah, if it's uh, my place, I'll cut that tree down. But anyway, it's good. Here comes the big Star Wars guy. See that? And what do you think about the system, mister? Hey guys, KGVR Trooper here, and I'm happy as hell about my 250-watt uh, solar power watt array here. Uh, put together by JW Solar USA at YouTube. Uh, those are my 250s. This is my 320. And soon those will be going on an RV and I'm going off the grid completely so look for that sometime this fall probably uh, first of September or so these things will be on a camper I'll have a battery system so I'll be charging my batteries like Johnny Solar does and living with free power on my RV out in the middle of nowhere no more debt brother no more <laughs> debt going from eight hundred and fifty dollars a month to three hundred and fifty dollars a month for living Mm -hmm. Can't beat that. That savings I could put in the bank and buy more panels and a wind power system to put on my RV for the winter months. So stay tuned. And check out Johnny's channel. Yeah, all right, guys. You know, you heard it from the man, and this is a clear 
uh, representation of this guy, what he's doing here. Look at this. This is just a temporal setup we did here. So don't please don't criticize us for just doing this. The thing was sitting in the ground, but he has been cranking some power all the past couple couple years. And I said, no, I can't take this anymore. We have to elevate this. So I came came over, brought some lumber, and set up this one whole entire stuff. And he's so liking it. And we put them horizontal instead of vertical. They were vertical, but we go horizontal. So now by elevating them with uh, I think it's uh, four by twos, whatever you call them. I'm not carpenter, but anyway. They got some bunch of stuff here. See the sun? These panels are 250 watt each tied in parallel. So now we're pushing a high voltage because the grid tied inverter can take from uh, 55 to, I think 45 to 90 volt. So that's why we're pushing all that kind of power. Well, the 320 is right over there, which is uh, making some power, but it's still blocking it because it's He's barbecuing here. Look at that. Woo wee. Yeah. I don't want I don't want him to open that because I'm gonna be hungry. I'm going home anyway. So folks, this is the uh, problem we have here. That's his house. Look at the trees. You make the judgment. This guy's push already put about six one something kilowatts of power. The sun is right right there, and summertime he's gonna be sorry because the tree is gonna be sitting there, but he's leaving this house, you know, he's gonna be doing his thing like you got heard him what he said he just said he stopped giving his money to the um, renters anymore so look at the trees look look how tall the trees are I'm panning the camera all the way down take a look bang and here he's tired of it I don't blame him but here is the open sky right there and he's collecting power he has the evening he has from the afternoon morning afternoon Oh, there's a moon right there. Oh, look at that. Got it on camera, the moon. This is nice. And uh, the sun comes up from there by around 10, 11 o'clock. And it's hitting the 320. It's, it's hitting that 320, 320 right there. And from here, you will see it started generating power around 11 and the sun is moving it's hitting the panels from this end right here far corner and the sun is traveling traveling passing the trees he has the entire evening all the way till dusk it's beautiful look at that didn't you just like that that will be on our screen right there this is beautiful i'll save that picture so there's a good 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 view beautiful well let's keep it this way and uh, you guys see and uh, people were, were having a uh, kind of doubt about the power jack and look at the trees you know start having leaves and the power jack is taking care of business here this is just a temporal setup because he's gonna be doing this thing later and I hope you guys understand that but this is just a temporary setup just take the panels from the ground so that you can able to utilize them the way it should be all right let's go take a look at the power again one more time well we're still shooting about 164 168 that's not bad at all 170 was 180 earlier but he's still standing back um, at the back there so he kind of shadow the system back and forth which is okay the 320 is pushing power right there and the dog is standing there most of the time nobody is there so it doesn't have no obstruction so since our objects are going back and forth this is the the deal but uh, everything seems to be running perfectly okay you can see the green light there flashing, telling you it's bringing power. When it goes red, then that means uh, kind of obstruction or maybe go below. Let's take a look at that. Yeah. So you guys go to KGVR Trooper 
make sure you subscribe like and share because you're gonna see um, all the good stuff he's gonna be doing he's a Star Wars guy and you wanna have any kind of questions about Star Wars and whatever if you're a big fan hey you guys can talk to each other now we just get a cloud all right just a cloud just slam the power <laughs> all right that's that's interesting <laughs> The, the cloud just came in just cloud, yeah, yeah. Check, check this out that you guys can just see, see the cloud well this is what serious connection can do to you <laughs> <laughs> look look at that big thing and it's coming back the sun is coming out <laughs> look see that <laughs> So what do you think about the clouds? You hate the clouds, don't well, you? I hate the clouds, but you know what's going to bring it forth an interesting question, and that is, for a grid tie system, are these panels in my setup going to run better in series or in parallel? We're going to run them both and let you know in the future to see which one puts the most power and stops my meter. Well, that's exactly, look at that thing. <laughs> it just killed the power right away. <laughs> Well, anyway, that's how I'm wrapping up the video and this is JW Solo USA. Please check out the KGVR Trooper and see his channel and please um, help him out. Subscribe, like and share and thumbs up. Comment on his uh, Star Wars program or whatever and his solar and his uh, off-grid transitional he's going to be doing. Well, you guys are going to be seeing uh, the latest that's coming up from this channel, how he's going to transition to the RV program live from Minnesota. Thanks for watching. Bye now.